let's look at different types of aspects and benefits of this coded aperture. One, of course, allows you to compute the capture an image in depth just from a single image, and there is no real loss of image resolution. For a simple modification to a lens, again, I don't recommend doing to a very your favorite lens. Depth is, of course, coarse, and we saw examples of that. I mean, again, we're trying to get something out of nothing. You get a little bit of depth, but not very much, and again, that is because we're trying to basically get this out of by creating focus planes by actually changing how the focus looks like differently because of the coded aperture. But, you know, we get depth. Of course, we lose light, and we know that, right, because we have smaller openings than this one. That basically means the light sensitivity in your lens or the camera is going to go down. Darker scenes won't work very well. But again, we can actually do deconvolution and increase depth of field after the fact from a single image. So in essence, this is like a light field camera where we actually get defocusing and depth information by changing it something in front of the lens itself, the opening, or on the plane of the lens, rather than changing the sensor. Because in light field, that's what we did. Light field camera, we changed the sensors to be able to capture different types of lights.